This is the 2018 SCOP Middle School Quiz Bowl Series. This is round number four or packet number four. And here we go with the questions. Toss up number one. A man in this novel dresses as a woman to tell the fortunes of Blanche Ingram and his future wife. This novel's protagonist befriends Helen Burns when she attends Lowood School. In this novel, Grace Poole cares for the deranged Bertha Mason, who eventually burns down Thornfield Hall. For 10 points, name this novel whose title character marries the mysterious Mr. Rochester, a work by Charlotte Bronte. And the answer there, that novel is Jane Eyre. Toss-up number two. This god's son, this god's son, Tenages, was murdered by his four brothers over his scientific prowess. And this god's daughter, Pasiphae, was wife of King Minos. This god had a sacred herd on Thrinacia, and his daughter Circe warned Odysseus against killing the cattle this god kept there. Phaethon, another son of this god, died while trying to control this god's chariot. For ten points, name this Greek god the personification of the sun. And the answer there, that would be Helios. Toss-up number three. The hydrocarbon haze surrounding Titan contributes to the anti-form of this process. Svant Arrhenius linked this effect to a rise in carbon dioxide concentration, and a runaway form of it caused Venus to develop extreme global warming. For 10 points, name this effect in which atmospheric gases absorb thermal radiation and redirect it back to, er to Earth's surface, generating higher average temperatures. And so that would be the greenhouse effect. I would have had to prompt on global warming. Oh, and I would have also had to prompt on climate change. Toss-up number four. A performer of this instrument used it to imitate a preacher's voice on the track Psalm. This instrument was played by a performer who used sheets of sound on albums like A Love Supreme and Giant Steps. This instrument was played by John Coltrane, who collaborated with jazz trumpeter Miles Davis. For 10 points, name this woodwind instrument that, in school wind bands, commonly comes in alto and tenor forms. The answer there, that would be the saxophone, or just sax, if you happen to say just that. Toss at number five. The story of Laura Bridgman inspired this figure's mother to meet with Alexander Graham Bell. This co-founder of the ACLU later dedicated her autobiography, The Story of My Life, to Bell. The play, The Miracle Worker, details Ann Sullivan's work teaching this woman hand signals for words like water. For 10 points, name this activist and author from Alabama who, as a result of a childhood fever, was deaf and blind. The answer there, that would be Helen Keller. Thoughts at number six. A transversal passing through two lines with this property creates equal alternate angles. A kite has no sides with this property, and if the opposite sides of a rhombus have this property, the rhombus is actually a square. Two lines with this property are always the same distance apart. For 10 points, name this adjective from geometry that describes two lines that never intersect. The answer there, those would be parallel lines. Toss-up number seven. This writer noted that tyranny, like hell, is not easily conquered. In a work that opens, these are the times that try men's souls. This author of The Crisis wrote an investigation of true and fabulous theology that advocated deism, as well as a 1776 work that argued for independence from Britain. For 10 points, name this early American pamphleteer who wrote The Age of Reason and Common Sense. The answer there, that would be Thomas Paine. Toss-up number eight. 
Warehouses called Horia were first built in this city where working class families lived in apartments called Insulae. This city was connected to Brindisi by the Appian Way, where followers of Spartacus were crucified. A valley between the Aventine and Palatine hills was the site of this city's Circus Maximus, a racing stadium near the Colosseum. For 10 points, name this ancient city the center of a massive Italian empire. The answer there, that would be Roma or Rome, either one. Toss up number nine. This author wrote about a character who jumps to reach a branch before deciding that he doesn't want the title fruit. A character created by this man begs a group of insects for food because he spent the summer playing music. Slow and Steady Wins the Race is a moral created by, for 10 points, what Greek author of fables such as the fox and the grapes, the ants and the grasshopper, and the tortoise and the hare. The answer there, that would be Aesop. Toss up number 10. A waste product generated by these organisms is called ambergris. The hippopotamus is the closest land relative of these animals. Some of these animals use baleen to filter krill, and the singing of the humpback species can travel hundreds of miles. For 10 points, name this group of aquatic mammals whose blue species is the largest animal that ever lived. The answer there, those would be whales. I could have also accepted cetaceans. Toss up number 11. This artist sings of her dream to have a family, a house, and everything in between in a song with Khaled and Benny Blanco. On the 2017 album Hopeless Fountain Kingdom, this singer notes that a former boyfriend, quote, wants me in the kitchen with a dinner plate, unquote. With Andrew Taggart, this artist repeats, we ain't ever getting older in another song. For 10 points, name this singer of Bad at Love who collaborated with the Chainsmokers on Closer. The answer there, that would be Halsey. I could have also accepted what appears to be her real name, Ashley Nicolette Frangipane, if you happen to know that. Toss-up number 12. A failed exploration of this river ended when Robert de la Salle's men killed him. This river named the civilization that created the Cahoica Mounds. This river flowed backwards during the New Madrid earthquake and has its source at Lake Itasca in Minnesota. For 10 points, name this river that flows through New Orleans and with the Missouri River forms the United States' longest river system. The answer there, that would be the Mississippi River. Toss up 13. One sect of this religion contemplates questions known as cones, and the ideals of this religion are known as the Three Jewels. Adherents of this religion follow the Eightfold Path, and the two main branches are Theravada and Mahayana. For 10 points, name this religion founded by Siddhartha Gautama, whose followers strive to achieve Nirvana. that answer would be Buddhism. Toss up number 14. This literary character puts a barber's bowl on his head because he believes that it is the helmet of Mambrino and duels with Samson Carrasco, who dresses up as a knight of the white moon. The elderly horse Rocinante is the, ste is the steed of this character, who falls in love with the farm girl Dulcinea and fights windmills with his companion Sancho Panza. For 10 points, name this title knight of a novel by Miguel de Cervantes. The answer there, that would be Don Quixote. Could have also... I could have also accepted El Ingenioso Hidalgo Don Quixote de la Mancha, if you knew the full title. Toss-up number 15. These processes appear as horizontal lines on heating curves, and the temperature at which these processes take place, takes place is affected by the Van, Hon 
the Van't Hoff factor. Sublimation is one of these events. Two other examples take place for pure water at zero and 100 degrees Celsius. For 10 points, name this type of process, examples of which include melting and boiling. The answer there, that would, those would be phase changes or phase transitions. I could have also accepted specific phase changes like freezing, melting, or boiling before these were mentioned in the question. Toss up 16. This city's land includes Stone Cutters Island, which is now connected to the Kowloon Peninsula. This city's Bank of China Tower is among its over 300 skyscrapers, the most in any city in the world. This city is a special administrative region and separated from its colonizers two years before its neighbor, Macau. In 1997, the British gave up control of, for 10 points, what very densely populated Chinese city. And that Chinese city is Hong Kong. Toss up number 17. A strong man who ruled this country gained power in the revolt of the sergeants and lost it in the 26th of July movement. Fulgencio Batista was overthrown in this country in 1959 by Che Guevara and a man who ruled this country until 2008. Hundreds of thousands of exiled people from this country live in Florida, 90 miles to the north. For 10 points, name this country, once ruled by Fidel Castro from Havana. The answer there, that would be Cuba. Toss up 18. In this play, Judge Danforth com demands a signed confession from a prisoner. A young girl in this play faints after dancing in the forest with her cousin Abigail and her father's slave to tuba. In this play, Giles Corey asks for more weight while being pressed to death. And John Proctor is hanged for refusing to admit to false claims of witchcraft. For 10 points, name this play about the Salem Witch Trials, written by Arthur Miller. The answer there, that would be The Crucible. Toss-up number 19. About 9 billion transition cycles of cesium-133 define this unit and a pendulum 999.4 999 centimeters long will precisely measure two of them. The ampere is the ratio of a coulomb to this unit, and the watt is the ratio of a joule to it. Hertz is the reciprocal of this unit that appears squared in the standard unit of force. For 10 points, name this SI base unit of time, 60 of which are in a minute. The answer there, those would be seconds. In the final toss-up of this packet, one of these objects sits on the windowsill in the Albrecht Durer engraving St. Jerome in his study, and another of these objects is stretched diagonally across the bottom of Holbein's The Ambassadors. In art, these objects are used as vanitas or memento mori, artistic reminders of the viewer's mortality. For 10 points, name these human bones used to represent death. The answer there, that would be a skull, a human skull. I would have had to prompt or ask you to be more specific on skeleton, head, or bone before it was read. And that concludes. This was the round four or packet number four of the 2018 SCOP Middle School Quiz Bowl Tournament. Thank you for listening.